All right, you've been listening to a COVID-19 update out of the state of Washington with Governor Jay Inslee, but we want to switch gears here and move to Minnesota, where there's been a number of protests in Minneapolis throughout the day um, in the memory of George Floyd in that recent news about the, the officer who killed him, Derek Chauvin. We want to go out now to Fox 9's Sarah Danik, who's in the middle of those protests. Sarah, how long have they been there today? day of protests uh, here in Minneapolis. This specific protest started at about 6 o'clock and we're now at the first precinct in downtown Minneapolis, one of the police stations here in town. That's really been a, a place that a lot of these protests end up. You can see a pretty good sized crowd here tonight and this is a group that's just, you know, stunned about the news yesterday, shocked, upset, uh, very emotional about the news that Derek Chauvin was released on bond. He was being held on a $1 million bond paid uh, that 10 percent of that bond and was able to walk free and this uh, this crowd just upset that he is able to be at home while they say that uh, you know justice is not being served to George Floyd his trial the trials are not uh, until March uh, at this point but he is free until that time on bond and the group here just says they don't want George Floyd to be forgotten. They want justice for George Floyd and they want his name to be remembered. They said uh, they will not be quiet. They want to make sure that, that this, uh, you know, that they're out every night and that they're out uh, trying to get justice. And again, just upset that Derek Chauvin is out on bond tonight. That happened yesterday. And again, the second night of protests here, guys. So far, things have remained peaceful. We've been marching for about a half hour. Um, and again, here at the first precinct in downtown Minneapolis. I'll send it back. Sarah, we're, we're uh, hearing that there were several arrests that were made yesterday. Have there been any arrests made today, or has it been mostly peaceful? Yeah, it's been peaceful. I mean, we haven't seen really any police officers here. Everybody stayed. Uh, we started off at the Hennepin County Government Center, where a lot of the court cases are heard, uh, and then marched down here to the police station, and I'm sure we'll continue back to the Government Center. But we really haven't seen any officers out. Um, there are kind of unofficial street marshals that watch the crowd and make sure everybody is safe, make sure everybody has their masks on. They've been very vigilant about that um, throughout all these protests, so that's uh, been a good thing. But um, but no arrests so far that we know of. Again, last night, that it was kind of a splinter group that went off of earlier protests in the night is when uh, that sort of happened. But uh, we know of a, of a protest here in Minneapolis and then one that was taking place in St. Paul uh, not too long ago as well. So, But so far here in Minneapolis, it's been um, a, a peaceful protest, we'd say. All right, Fox 9's Sarah Denick there on the streets of Minneapolis following those protests.